Hello, I am doing a short series of videos on um, polycythemia, polycythemia vera in the media. Um, I know that when I was told or diagnosed um, with polycythemia, I was told that it was a very rare disease um, and, you know, pretty much unheard of in so many instances. So I thought, well, that's, you know, interesting. Um, now, uh, as I've learned through other people, it's not as rare as it was. Obviously, numbers go up with more, you know, um, people looking into it, right? And, um, but it's not common still. So, it is interesting to see it in media outlets in one way or another. Today, I'm going to let you know about Star Trek. The original Star Trek mentions it. It's actually kind of cool. Um... Season 3, Episode 8, Dr. McCoy has done a physical exam on everyone on the Starship Enterprise, right? And he has to report to the captain. And so he says, hey, you know, looks like everyone's doing great and, you know, we're looking good, except one exception, right? And it turns out, um, oh, what is it? Disclaimer, I'm going to totally ruin the episode, but it is fun, so watch it anyhow. Um, Dr. McCoy is actually the one who does have xenopolycythemia and he says it's a terminal disease he has a year to live so um, that's part of the premises of premise of this show um, it's actually fun to watch I have to say even even if I've totally ruined the end for you watch it it is fun to watch old TV shows and especially Star Trek of all cool things like they have just randomness anyway it's fantastic watch it um season three episode eight it's called for the world is hollow and i have touched the sky um in the end he is cured all is well you can continue watching star trek and feel good that he had a cure heaven only knows you know where that cure is but pretty awesome somebody got cured right anyhow i totally recommend it i'm gonna do um a little link on the bottom here um, where you can look at um, just even buying the videos on Amazon also um, you can buy I, I actually bought one episode for three dollars but I think you can buy the series for less or even get it free on Amazon Prime depending on what they what deal they have by the time you watch this anyway it's kind of cool um, anyway I loved it enjoy Star Trek it's a classic